my name is Lexi Bailey and I am playing Crystal and the Audrey 2 understudy. Hi, my name is Yasir Mohammed and I play Shafan. Hi, I'm Selena and I play Ronette. And I, I'm from Oak Park, Illinois, born and raised, and I've spent the last five years in New York, but due to the pandemic, I've been home in Chicago, and this has been one of the greatest things I could have hoped for in the last year. I'm just so grateful to have joined the Chicago theater community and to join the Metropolis family. I'm just so grateful and so excited to be home. <laughs> Well, I am a children's uh, theater educator throughout the Chicagoland area and performer. And with the pandemic, it's kind of obviously put everything at a standstill. So I have um, been waiting to see what this year looks like. Um, so I was researching and doing a little bit of research on, you know, what's up and coming and actually just put in a Google search of Chicago shows happening. And I saw auditions for Little Shop and I kind of just jumped on it immediately and was super, super excited. <laughs> I do like I do theater in the Chicagoland area and I've um, been doing it for a while. And then like when we hit like when we hit our hiatus, our one year hiatus, um, uh, seeing this, a friend of mine had actually sent me the link to, to the show. It was like, hey, like, you know, Metropolis Theater is doing a little shop of horrors. You know, you should try it. And uh, and when I saw that, I was like, yes, it's an opportunity for theater to come back. Oh my God, finally. Um, and so here I am. I just love how close the urchins are. I know that some of the examples we've used are they're kind of like the Skylar sisters. If Peggy was a boy and they had a brother. Um, and I, I do feel like they have this connection. I'm not sure if it's familial or like alien-esque, but they're so connected and it's been so amazing connecting with Lexi and Yasir. I know we haven't met in person, but I already just feel so much love for them and the energy is so good. And I know that's gonna translate on stage when we finally get to meet in person. Such a family, such, so connected, even through these Zoom screens and rehearsals. Uh, we're we're so on the same wavelength all the time. I, even when we text each other outside of rehearsals, I'll be like, oh, I just told Lexi that I thought this was going to be epic. Like we're using the same words in real life and it's totally going to reflect on stage. Oh, the cop, no, uh, uh, no. uh, I know it's funny. Like I, I thought that this would be like one of the questions too. Um, <laughs> I like, when I was uh, called back for the show as uh, one of the urchins, I was like, uh, I was like, like blown away of the of the idea that that you know that could like serve as like a possibility because like I had never like I had never like heard of it or thought of that and like when I had shared with my peers, they were like, huh, that's really interesting. But like knowing like just knowing the way that like that I play and like my vocal range, like it like it fits and. Um, and then like, you know, being cast as Chiffon and then like working, you know, working with the other urchins, um, there's, there's like this, there's this level of, of connection and self-empowerment, especially as a black performer that like really like keeps it like well knit that like, I feel like very, very proud that I get to, uh, serve my purpose as like a black man and, and like, uh, work, like working, to, uh, working together with, uh, you know, like the black, like, black women of the show and like just having like that strong like force that strong unit it's 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 beautiful it's